The finals, it's here. The 2016 Super Retriever Series Crown Championship in Huntsville, Alabama. We're here at Cove Park. And uh, Chris, this is what we, we've been waiting for. And we had some drama in that in that fourth round. No doubt about it. I tell you what, those dogs laid down on us is what they did. You know, it, it took a, a dog with a lot of age to get here, that kind of training, that kind of experience, that kind of time in the field. Well, this, this day was super physical. You know, we ran over here in the, in the Cypress Pond and in the shallow mud, and man, it was tough on them. Those old dogs came over here and they were out of gas. I mean, they didn't have the horsepower and they just couldn't get the job done today like they should have. The average age of the, of the finalists is almost 10 years old. It's an incredible feat when you think about the, the age of these dogs and what they've been able to do. All four dogs age eight and above, from age eight to 11. So your leaders right now, Dude coming in uh, with 76 points, Drake with uh, Tommy Harp, the amateur, already won the amateur championship, 86 points, 96 points for Trigger, and then the biggest story probably would be how General, who led the whole way, fell all the way down and missed it by a whistle. Well, half a whistle, one half point. Half a whistle, one point. One point. You know, I think the best performance we saw today in my eyes was definitely Drake. And, uh, you know, I mean, I'll tell you what, the wheels flew off of General today. And I mean, but here again, I'm thinking these dogs were just out of gas and, and uh, they just they didn't have the energy to, to do that big swim. I think it was a 194 yard watermark, basically swimming the whole way. And all of them decided to bail out early and get the short version. It just, taught, it just caused chaos from that point forward. Well, Lyle Steinman told us that the general was nursing an Achilles injury and it came back, it finally showed up here in that last fourth round. So we'll see what happens. It's the finals, four dogs left. We'll see who wants to take it all. Uh, my name's Lyle Steinman and I'm from Gower, Missouri. And this is General. General's nine years old. Uh, he ran the SRS for whew, seven years now with Northrop Larson. And, and so I've had General for, oh my, five, six years or longer. And, um, he's always been taken for granted. Uh, he's always lived in the shadows of Jack and, and some of them great dogs. And, and he's kind of like Ribby. He's always uh, that blue collar worker that just doesn't give it, you know, doesn't get any credit. And it's kind of like hard to believe. Last year he was third to, to Indian dude. And then the year before he was second to dude. He's just, uh, he's always been there and you can always count on him. And, and I mean, he looked like he had two of the best runs I've ever had in, in, in the Crown Series, the first two. And in that third series, I felt the, the lug nuts were starting to loosen on the wheels a little bit. And early August, he sustained a, a serious injury, Achilles tendon pull, maybe a tear. And so Steph and, and took him to the vet and took him to a specialist and we fitted him for a, a special, I call a Terminator boot and he wore that and he was in the crate for pretty well since the first week in August. So, I mean, he's had very little training and it's huge. I mean, it is, to get here, I mean, I've ran 10 of these and walking down the path with Stephanie. Uh, I've been in this thing nine times out of 10, you know, and Steven and I have been in a lot of wars together, you know, and uh, I told Steven back at the truck, enjoy dude's last run. You know, this will be dude's last crown. And, you know, you, you, you hate to say it, I, I've, I've been predicting an amateur to win and, and Tommy's there to win and, and Clark's dog trigger is, he's the right age and I told Clark before we come, it's now or never. He's seven, he's got to do it. And, and we, we take these old dogs that, that they're perfect and they can run forever and, and they can't. So it's extremely emotional for me, but to say, you know, I know what Steven feels, I know what he feels. The last bird is always the last, the hardest one to take because you know this is the last time I'll reach down and take the bird from in this in this kind of scenario. So I mean, it, it's you can see emotion. Other handlers can see emotion. They don't think they can, but the ones that have been there can. Can we get five birds and line the blind? Hmm? <laughs> Here, smart. Sit. You found him. Good. General. Open safe.
General. General. Whoo, boys. Sure we can get the one on the parking lot. Here, 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 way out. That's right. That's exactly where we're going. Here, set. Here, 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 set. Here, no, here, here, set. Here. Come on, heal, dead bird. Here, dead, here, 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 sit, dead. Here, 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 there, no, no, sit.
Bom dia.